Ocean, Rofor is here to talk about the differences of oceanic lithosphere and continental lithosphere. But before we discuss the difference of oceanic lithosphere and continental lithosphere, let us talk about lithosphere. Lithosphere. Solid and rigid outer layer of the earth. Fun fact. Did you know the term of lithosphere was created from a Greek term? Yes, in Greek, litho refers to a rocky and sapphire refers to the sphere. Since our Earth's outer layer is but a solid crust, the given name was coined by scientists. The lithosphere is made up of the quas in the region of the upper mantle that exhibits elastic behavior at time scales of at least a few thousand years. It floats in a semi-plastic layer called the asthenosphere. Another fun fact, geologist Joseph Barrell observed the gravity anomalies over the continental crust and put forward the theory of a solid upper crust which he called the lithosphere, with an underlying semi-molten layer termed as a stenosphere. The lithosphere is not as solid as you might believe though. It has a crack that observed both in the continent and the ocean floor. Due to these cracks, the lithosphere is broken into similar sections called tectonic plate. The sphere can be subdivided by oceanic lithosphere and continental lithosphere. The oceanic lithosphere is linked to the oceanic crust found on the oceanic floor, whereas the continental lithosphere is linked to the exposed land masses. And now, let's talk about their differences. Number 1. Thickness. Oceanic crust has a thickness of 7 to 10 kilometers, which is much thinner than the continental crust which has a thickness of 25 to 70 kilometers. Number 2 density. A continental plate has an average density of 2.7 grams cubic centimeter while the oceanic plate has an average density of 3.0 grams per cubic centimeter. Number 3. Age. When compared to the continental plate, Oceanic plates are shown to be considerably younger using radioactive dating methods. The oldest continental crust is around 4 billion years old, and the oldest oceanic crust is roughly 260 million years old. Radioactive dating is a method that utilizes radioactive elements to calculate the age in years of geologic materials, such as rocks and minerals. Number 4. Rock Composition Further investigation showed that basaltic rocks make up the majority of the oceanic plates, whereas granitic rocks make up the majority of the continental plates. Now we are done discussing. Let's have a small recap. The lithosphere is a solid and rigid outer layer of our planet. The lithosphere is made up of crust and upper mantle. It floats in a semi-plastic layer called asthenosphere. There are two types of lithosphere, the oceanic lithosphere and continental lithosphere. The oceanic lithosphere is linked to the oceanic crust found on ocean floor. The continental lithosphere is linked to the exposed land masses. The oceanic crust is relatively younger than the continental crust. The oceanic lithosphere is thinner than the continental lithosphere. The oceanic lithosphere is denser as compared to the continental lithosphere. The oceanic crust is primarily composed of basaltic rocks while the continental crust is primarily composed of granitic rocks.